Today I would like to show you Jamboard. It is available as part of the G Suite for Education. If you don't have it as part of your G Suite, that means that your uh, Google Administrator has not activated it for your domain and you need to speak with him or her. So to find this, you can go to the Google Apps Launcher and go down and find Jamboard. It might be in these below. Or you can just go directly to jamboard.google.com. Now, one of the really cool things that, al that Google allows us to do is to be in a document in more than one place. So I'm going to create a new jam. And I'm going to come up here and title it Practice Jam. Now, these were originally designed to go with the hardware called a Jamboard, hence Google Jamboard. Uh, but you do not have to have the official Jamboard to actually be able to use the software. This is a really cool whiteboard space that anybody with a Google account can use. So over on my iPad, I am going to come over and open my Jamboard app. And I'm going to pull down a do or refresh to make sure that both devices have the latest Jamboards available to me. And here I see Practice Jam. So I'm going to go ahead and open it. And now I can have my whiteboard space and I'm using an Apple pen, pencil, but you can use any stylus or even your finger to write on your whiteboard. And you will see it show up on your desktop screen. So this would allow teachers to um, you know, as a former math teacher, I would think that this would be a good way to demonstrate mathematical properties, mathematical examples for your students. Um, if you needed to uh, add some other things in, you can add uh, sticky notes and images and stickers even. So if we wanted to add a sticker to something, we could easily add the sticker. right there. All we have to do is undo and there's our sticker. So we can easily then move that sticker around, resize that sticker, rotate that sticker. We can do a lot of things with that sticker or any of the other stickers for that matter. But that's a quick introduction to Jamboard.